Hey everybody, this is Kuimpak with Let's Play Zoo Tycoon DS, and we are going to build one more animal cage. It is May in the game. We have been, like, Savannah. We were going to make a Savannah creature. Uh, how about a, how about a Plippo? Plippo. Water reed? What? We can make it a hippopotamus. Uh, do 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 I mean, I don't, like, personally, I don't think a hippo could get over a half wall, but in this game, I don't even know if the walls make a damn difference. On the PZ they do, animals can escape. But on this version, I'm not actually sure. Oops. Again, I've made mistakes. Uh, I'm not actually sure if the animals can escape. I mean, we've seen that the, the fences do rust eventually. Rust? Rust? Okay, we need a savanna type. Needs a savanna type beat. Needs to be an R&B remix. Remix. There needs to be a large watering hole in the corner. Got one foot in the grave. Someone tells me that this isn't exactly the environment that the, uh, Hippopotamus once. Needs more water, less savanna, but it has the right amount of dirt. <laughs> oh, God. Uh, so this is going to get funny. So for one, we're going we're gonna to stamp it up. We're going to stamp it in the corner here. And we are going to... Give it more water. I was clicking on the wrong part of the screen. Wants more dirt, less savanna. Oh, okay, okay, yeah, 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 yeah. And it likes the water reed, so we're gonna go get it some water reed. These are fences. Uh, it needs a concrete shelter, I presume. I'm gonna be presumptuous and just presume you want one of these, buddy. It is exactly what you want it. Oh, just what I need it! You know what I just realized? We, we are really just recreating Putt Putt. Putt Putt. Saves the zoo. No, you you don't like water. Though. I know an animal does though. There is one that does. Oh, thank you for the money. I appreciate that. I'm like needed that money for, for forever ago, but you know, okay. All right, I'll accept. I'll take your money with with the grain of salt. Hey, tour guides will make people happier. Oh my god, and all the cash is pouring in this month. We've gotten all the cash bonuses. Just when I, I guess the hippo did it. Oh, a hippopotamus. Now I understand. The zoo will be great. Okay, the people have escaped the death loop, and I don't know how. Do they, do they slip between? How'd you guys find your way out? I mean, I'm okay with you finding your way out. There is a zoo in here. There's a presumed zoo you can visit. <laughs> There's a zoo, and we got animals. We got a lot of little animals. There's some animals, big and small animals.
And I personally don't like a zoo with dead ends, but you know, sometimes that just has to happen. I'm gonna say it though, I really wish these Zob's decks worked. Because I'm unsure if they do or don't. We're gonna put some over here, sure, but... Wooden observation area. All right, I've put some observation areas in. Uh, I don't want an elephant statue right here. All right, I built some aesthetics to the zoo. The zoo, the zoo now has some aesthetics to it. It's not all just baseline idiocy. Funny now, we can put in another animal. Tempted to. Some of the original trail back. Guests seem happy with your zoo. There we go. Branching paths to prove your worth. Will you be part of the new rebirth? Let's go grab some cards real fast with this money. Uh, cards we already have, that's depressing. I don't want to spend all our money on it yet. And one more, because we're going to spend money on a thing. God, those were some abysmal pulls. I'm not really a big fan of the chain fence. I really am not. One of the cheaper options in the whole thing. Concrete chain fence allows for people to see in, and it's a strong option, but it's expensive. But it's okay, we're gonna need expensive. So what we what we're doing over here, putting in a massive exhibit, a big exhibit, the big exhibit. What are we gonna put in the big exhibit? Well, obviously, we're gonna go get ourselves an elephant. But only after I get the terrain type right. We gotta we gotta at least get the baseline down. This is where our elephant is gonna go. You know, I built that elephant statue. It wasn't an it wasn't an irredeemable purchase. I did it on purpose. I need to know the borders of you. God damn. That's where the water is. Elephants are going to be a little bit hard to put in there. What do they want? The Jadu tree? No, they want a Baobab, right? I'm pretty sure it's a Baobab, right? He needs rocks. He just wants the one Baobab tree. He then needs more sand, less grass. Okay, sand. 
than water. Uh. More dirt, less mana. Wait, did that guy? Did I staff assign you? I did. Get in there and take care of that elephant. The most vocal animal we've had in a long time. Oh, elephant trunk toy. Yeah, this is where that this comes in. What are we missing? Water and savannah? Yeah, yeah, I guess that makes sense. Elephant. Elephant. Elephante. We did it. Zoo happiness is a, still 93. Zoo rating is at a 77. So, everyone happy now? Let's get slapping now. Bum, 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 ba -dum, bum. So why does this exist over here? I'll tell you why. We're gonna make a second food port over here. This red brick area is gonna be where we put up our second food court. This, of course, is going to take up some space. I'm okay, but I want people to be able to eat lunch around the elephants. This is going to be the purpose of our city zoo. I mean, the restaurant accum accumulates large crowds of people in a drink stand. Which ones did we build? Blue and green roof? Let's go get a yellow roof. And a red roof. You can get pizza, you can get burgers, french fries. Like, I don't know what the gift shop really does, to be honest. <laughs> it, it, it. Congratulations, you have given the Blue Ribbon Award highest customer satisfaction for making guests with the Zoo Memorial. This award comes with a bonus of 25000 Holy shit. Thank you for the money. You know what? I'm buying some cards with that shit. Oh, but I gotta buy a bathroom. There's no bathroom on this side. Uh, we might have problems. We gotta build a toilet. That's not a toilet. That is an animal house. There we go. Toilet near near the second one. I guess we can still build a gift shop. Oh, we can build it, like, right here, though, right? I think that's just the best place to put it. I was, I mean, we could put an animal house there. Nah, let's build the gift shop and see how, how much, like, for us.
We did follow some of the original guideline of the path I deleted at the start. Amazingly enough. Excellent, great, beauty, beauty. Well, no snow house for these guys. Kinda depressed about that. Check out our exhibit, Popularity Real Fast. Check it out. Oh, yeah. Two stars. Two stars. Holy shit. One star. Oh, he really likes the mandrel. Ant Eater has made zero dollars. Holy shit. Well, now we know. Elephon is new, so I expect it to make zero bucks. But, you know, it'll take time. That Ant Eater has made zero bucks. Don't worry, I'm going to purchase some more cards to my addiction. To my great dismay, I can't seem to get a rare one. Keep getting dupes, which is problematic. Clear the scenario, you keep the cards. What is this? Don't do this to me. I'll make a, I'll make a state the cheese pulls, because we need new cards, please. No, it seems to be all the same card, so this is depressing. What the? No. We'll do one reroll. You know what? It seems to be the same cards every time. We're just not going to buy. Nope, this level does not have cards outside of that one. I know I unbirthed. Oh god, shouldn't say it that way, but that's going to be the only word that works. Uh, I rewound the birth of the wolf that we had. But that might be a bad thing, considering the wolves don't even have a shelter yet. And they, you know, as popular as they are. Are they gathering under the OBS deck? I can't tell. <laughs> Ninety-six happiness, ninety-nine happiness, seventy-eight zoo rating. Certainly aren't going over the Izob's deck. Whoa, the flickering is though it was gonna get me. I guess we'll spend some time just with Elephon. What a lot of this LP is just observing the animals more than the people. I mean, the people are caught in the deck loop again. And without one bitching per like just one bitching person makes it drop that much. But you know, everyone else, everyone else, 97, look at that. Deathloop zoos. They're an innovative way of the future. I don't know. Don't a majority of zoos have elephants or at least one planular African creature? It feels like they all do. Especially since a lot of them also have safaris. We have a hippo and an elephant. We, we could have squeezed the rhino over here instead of building a second food court. I'll be real. I'm pretty sure I don't need the second food court. I just feel aesthetically we should have built the second food court by now, so I did. I'd place a fountain around here because that's the other thing. A lot of zoos have fountain pictures. And they're always, like, really nice. Oh, I like how the elephant falls over dead. It's like, dead. I wonder why I don't have the ice house yet. Oh, it's because it's gate kept by a panda. 
I hate how the ice house is under conservation. And once the panda shows up, it's 99 days to fund it. You know what? Max it. Max it. I don't care. Max it. Spend our money now. We can't get cards here anyways. Congratulations. A par object is complete. No, there it is. The snow house. Finally, a bill. Okay, I'm gonna slightly less max the band of that. I mean, I felt it weird. I just felt it weird that we did not have the snow house yet. I think we watched enough elephant for now. These scenery objects tend to break the game's entire integrity while scrolling. Yeah, look at that. Blip, 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 blip. I mean, I tell you what, sometime down the line, we might play some real Zoo Tycoon. Maybe. Maybe. That's a maybe. No promises. And if we are, I'm going to play Zoo Tycoon 2. <laughs> I'm going to play the sequel game, baby, because we're going to have some real fun with the pet the animal feature. Oh my god, and in Zoo Tycoon 2, you can come down and you can touch the animals. Crazy. You can act like a zookeeper and not hire anybody and save money. You run around and do it all yourself. It's great. You can also build like intricate exhibits. I'm pretty sure you can view, build like upper viewing platforms. Like paths over the exhibits. Where people can view the animals internally by being above the exhibit limit. There's a lot of cool things you can do in Zoo Tycoon uh, too. I have the complete edition. It has like the trams and a bunch of the expansions. Like, I shouldn't say the complete. I think I have it the zookeeper's chest edition. So it's not the complete because there is there are two, there are two expansions missing from it because there are five total. I think for two. And I have it installed. It's not like I don't have it installed. It's a Microsoft game, so it can run on even the newest OS with. Fairly minimal compatibility issues. Crazy like that. I'm surprised none of our animals have died. It's August. Ugh. Whoa. Diagonal movement is breaking them all. Oh, so it seems to be left and right movement that breaks them. Because look. Oh, no, no, no. Rolling up broke it there. And I'm surprised none of these animals are dead. There is a little a little polypula girl over here, all the way over here on the other side of the hippo cage. All the way. Are you gonna donate? Give me your money. Give me your caps. Why was this so unpopular compared to this? And holy shit, a three star exhibit. Whoo! Popular animal, all right. Like, people love wolves. My god, do they love wolves. Don't make elfin noises at me, Elfon. I mean, people might actually like the hippo a lot, too, because this is getting money. Unlike this. Or really, the mandrel. I like the mandrel, but that's neither here nor there. Who doesn't allow to have opinion as the zoo owner? But yeah, holy shit, look at all the money we're making off of wolves. Look at our beautiful death loop. <laughs> oh my god, this has to have a negative effect at some point, right? Like, there's a negative ramification that builds up here at some point, correct? Hit feedback loop the happiness forever. Although, we've cleared the level. And I'm going to end the video here. So this has been Ku Impact with Let's Play Zoo Tycoon DS. Don't forget to subscribe, rate, and comment next time. God, I feel like we're suffering from success, so maybe I should go hire some more staff. Like, look at all that dirt. Get some more of these idiots in here. Employ some people. We've got money. I'm not buying any cards. All right, one more. I've been japed. Oh, I've been fucking japed. There's no cards in this level. RNG just won't. Literally no cards in this level. It is dependent on what zoo you're currently in, what 
set of cards you can pull from. So yeah, no, this place is trash. I'll see you all next time.